E Block Radio, baby. I know I knew finally it was going to kick in, baby. <laughs> finally. Check one, check two. Yo, E, what up, though? Cuz, what up, though? My man, Soul Deacon, just checked Soul in. Soul Deacon. <laughs> right, we got to get you back on the show, bro. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, that's a long name. Taj221911. What up, though? What up, though? Soul Deacon in the building. My man, EJ. Eric E.J. Johnson, Enrique. What up, bro? Enrique, what's up, baby? You know what I'm saying? We had a good conversation the other day, man, so definitely going to have to make some moves on that. Yeah. Uh, school in, make sure we good. Let's make sure you can, uh... Oh, yeah, they can see, see my you, though. They can see my, um, oh, yeah, you do got your T-shirt on, too, though, huh? Motherfucking apparel. Right, for sure, for sure. All right, we in there. I'm going to wait for a couple more people to chime in. For what? I don't know. Just just cuz, man. We're going to catch up, monster. I know. Damn, you know what, dog? <laughs> I'm trying to see was you was you venting with the with the microphones up? <laughs> Damn, that job gonna cut your ass loose. Do me a favor. Do you a favor. Do me a favor. <laughs> I do like some I nah. do low man. I don't think. Well, I don't know. That might have been old shit. I don't know. I don't give a fuck. Right, we want to talk about shit, but whole ass jobs whole like ass job. corporate America, man, y'all. Anyway, dog. Put the handcuffs on, nigga, for no reason. For sure. You ready though? Let go. Yeah. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The Live is Cloud radio show on the planet, man. Straight from the E-Block radio. Live on your dial right this moment, man. Live from the 48205. It's your boy, the hood Howard Stern, Q Lewis. Got my man Monk Money in the building. Man, you know I stand this bitch. You know what I'm saying? He and this bitch angry than a motherfucker, dog. It's all good, though. Man, it ain't all but good. But it's Friday, though. It's Friday. So that's a little exciting, right? It's almost a weekend. Fuck no, that's the busiest time for me. <laughs> so that don't mean I am shit, not dude. excited about that. Man, I gotta check ID Live, make sure I ain't got no buggers and shit. All right, but uh, <laughs> oh shit, damn, D will say yeah, we heard everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he don't like his job, man. It's all good. Good thing he wasn't talking about nothing outrageous. Right. <laughs> anyway, man, corporate America, dog. You know, you know, y'all suck a little bit, and I, I just I had to. It. So I just got to say this, man, because it is Friday, and I ain't gonna talk too much about it because uh, you know, uh, because of situations, but like General Motors just let go like fourteen, fifteen thousand people, man, bro. Corporate America is a beast, man. That's why, I like, at this point, it's like you you kind of got to you gotta figure out your own niche, man, and just roll with it because, yeah. dog, corporate America is just as shaky as your own business. Yeah. Like, you never know when you go wake up the next morning and, it's not and be there. it ain't going to be there. And you go find out on the news like everybody else. That's crazy. That's why people need to take heed to what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to motherfucking be, I'm finna entrepreneur myself, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> right, entrepreneur yourself. I'm seriously, bro, because I'm sick and tired of working hard for another motherfucker that's not really benefiting me. I yeah. get a job. I got a job, but it shit mean just over broke. So I mean, <laughs> just over broke. That mean I'm just over broke, and I just want to live comfortable. I ain't got to be rich in a motherfucking yeah. five-bedroom mansion. I don't need all that. Right. You know, so I mean, it'd be, cool. be, it'd be cool. <laughs> it'd be cool. It'd be cool. Five-bedroom. Right it's a fucking three-bedroom nice-ass place. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. That's what I'm trying to do, man. I'll get out here and get it on my own, man. People need to take heed to that, man. General Ramona, y'all getting these bow, y'all getting these checks. Motherfucker looking in the fucking building something. Y'all should learn from the Chrysler motherfuckers that got the day buyout. And now they broke as a motherfucker working at McDonald's. Y'all remember that, though? Yeah. They yeah. Is. I mean, you got to do something with that buyout, though. Like, yeah. when, when Chrysler gave that buyout, though, I think a lot of... Like, a lot of old people, they was cool because they kind of got the buyout and they still kind of got a yeah, pension. Yeah. But, like, people have been there, like, maybe 10 years. They took that buyout and didn't do shit. Like, you had to you had to take that buyout and, like, go to school, something. build you a business, do something with it. Because if you just went, like, to the crib and blew that bread, like, yeah, you probably yeah. working at McDonald's now. Yeah, Standing in line McDonald's. talking about you want $15. I was about to say. <laughs> I was just about to say I that. mean, no disrespect to y'all, no man. No disrespect but at all, but I'm you know just saying. saying. 
gym. Just you know what I'm saying. Santel, Santel what up though? I ain't, we ain't holler at you in a long time, man. I know you got probably got some good some good new music right now. What's what's popping, man? Send me some music. Right. Or you probably doing shows or something now, cause I know you popping right now. So okay, I hear you, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, hit us up though. You know what I'm saying. Hit us in the inbox or whatever. Let us see what what kind of music we got going on. Right. Yeah, you know she was one of our musical guests, like maybe ah two three years. It was a minute I, I ago. Remember, yeah, remember, yeah, remember. for sure. But um, yeah, what? Anyway, so let, let's 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 talk about something else. Though. I don't want to talk about corporate America, man, because it's, it's a little. Uh, yeah. I talked about it enough when we talked about. Like I know we <laughs> talking like a motherfucker <laughs> with the mic, so I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> yeah, we just fucked up a whole lot of jobs and shit right now. Man. This shit, this shit got to blow up. Now, got to blow up. We didn't talk shit about all our yeah, jobs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, uh, well, and, and they know about the house. Congratulations and shit, right? Well, oh yeah. <laughs> we hey. talked about that too. <laughs> Going to see hey. that right after the show. <laughs> Congratulations and shit. Thanks, thanks, bro. Thanks. <laughs> right. Everybody heard all that shit. So, you know what that means, right? What's that? That uh, after this show, this live version will not be available. We will be uh, posting the edited version. The edited version. Yeah, without all of the uh, conversations at the beginning. Yeah. But um, anyway, dog, what, what else is going on in the news, dog, since the other day? Because we was just here the other day. This is crazy. Yeah. I'm so used to doing like a whole did we, week. Did we say November the 9th is when um, legal weed is uh, legal to smoke on the street? Yeah. You just want to remind everybody? Because that's everybody. important. Yes, yes, that's important. This is the wake and bake show. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. Keep us a prop blunt. He is a prop blunt. E Block Radio Wake and Bake Show. What what else uh popped off? I'm trying to remember. Oh, dog, you see uh this this is like breaking news from yesterday. But you see uh the the lawyer, uh Trump's lawyer and shit, admitted to lying and, and uh like lying in in the in the first case and shit. So like he going to jail. So uh now I wonder what's gonna happen. Nothing to the president? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. You don't think so? Hell no, man. <laughs> Nothing, nothing, you not bro. convinced? No, it's just I mean, like, motherfuckers going to jail. There's got to be something. Man, he ain't going to jail, bro. Like, the I mo- mean, I, he not going to go to jail, but I'm just saying. Yeah, somebody going to jail, but not him. Right. But, and it's another thing. Like, Yo, these, too smooth. Just checked in IG Live. What up, though? What up, though? It's another thing with these motherfucking judges and shit, man. Yeah. They, they laid out these judges, but they got sex chambers in the basement. This nigga said sex chambers. Like that, bro. Like, it's a freaky motherfucker. you going to lay down the law and you breaking it? You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Like, just like the police, shit. Yeah. You know how that like, shit go? Just like the president. <laughs> the president. <laughs> ain't nothing gonna happen to that nigga, you don't ain't think? Ain't nothing gonna happen to him, bro. Yeah, so his lawyers and shit, or the one lawyer anyway, I guess he was, uh, you know, telling all these lies and shit, basically covering up some of the information that he knew about, you know, what was going on with the, uh, with the, re- with the, with the residents. What? He said, I ain't going to Mississippi. What's going on in Mississippi? I'm tripping. D Will, you gotta tell me what's popping. I don't even know what's going on in Mississippi. Yeah, tell me. What's I think I must I must have missed something. Uh, let me see. Oh, Chantel said uh, she got a single out straight coasting. It's popping, and she got some new music about to release after December. That's what's up. That's All right, right, bet. Send me that single though. You got my uh, email address, I believe. If not, uh, just uh, inbox me. I'll send it to you. Right. Devonte Riley just checked in. What up, though? Talk to us. We talk back. Yeah, yeah, yo. If y'all just now checking in, man, what we talking about today is uh, some other shit. Right now, we just kind of rambling on because it's the it's the morning wake and bake show. But uh, later on, though, we talking about um, women should they pay alimony after <laughs> divorce? That's what we want to know, bro. We want to know should women be paying alimony after divorce? But uh, D. Will, you got to tell me what's going on in uh, Mississippi because I have no idea. Dog, did you see this video, though? And I, I didn't want to talk about, uh, I didn't want to talk about what's called Dwight Howard ass no more shit. But did you see this video? Was that was that in our group text or that was another group that text where they showed, showed this nigga sit on the bench and just deliberately grab his man's dick, though? No. Like, I, <laughs> look, I know motherfuckers be playing and shit. But that's a little bit too much though. Like this is this is a nationally televised uh basketball game. This grown man go sit on the bench and grab this nigga dick. Um Oh yeah, D Will, I know what you're talking about. Know what you're talking about. The Senate raised down uh uh down down south of Mississippi. Uh one of the I think she was a senator, right? Uh won she won the election though. But this is a white lady who said that she was cool with lynching. I do remember that shit now. Yeah, so that was like a, yeah, so, yo, that's ill. She cool with Lynch. And now she's in office. Oh, my God. Right, exactly. That's that's the shit I'm talking about, dog. But my thing you is, though. Yeah, wake and bake, bro. We getting ready to bake in a minute. Yes, sir. <laughs> Here it is, right? Here. Right, there it is. That's the prop blunt. Prop blunt. <laughs> Jedi, Jedi Conley, Conley, Jedi. What up, though? You just checked in. That that guy. But, um, yeah, dog. So, yeah, I do remember that shit. And, uh, bro, it's Mississippi, bro. Mississippi. I I'm 
Mississippi, bro, Mississippi. is a place on earth that I will never understand and still slightly afraid of. <laughs> Still slightly afraid of. Uncle Wayne, you ain't here. We just say the topic like fucking four times, man. Like, come on, man. And, and it's right there. And it's right there on the screen. <laughs> it's bro. right there on the screen. Should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? We ain't there yet, though. Calm down. Relax. He don't want to talk about nasty nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga is nasty, <laughs> on He's a nasty motherfucker, <laughs> bro. I, I, dog. Is he, is he a fruit? Man, he's a fruit, bro. You, you think he said he was a fruit anyway? Man, you said that. Man. I was about to say last week. Monday. Monday, yeah, yeah he said that Monday. Fruit, bro. Trust I, me, bro. He might be though. Ain't no, I, I ain't no mic. Ain't no mic. Ain't no mic. <laughs> ain't no mic. Mm-hmm. Dude, that shit is crazy though, in Mississippi though. Yeah. But this, this is the thing though. Like you see these memes all the time. We go get off this because it's kind of man. It's Friday. I don't want to talk about that shit no more. Uh, Micho eighty five just checked in on IG live. What up, though? Micho. But um, yeah, I, dog. It's it's like that everywhere. Not just in the in the Senate office or in the government or in the police. Like it's the police department. Like all these motherfuckers got these views. That they bring, they bring in with them and, and taking it to their job. Mm-hmm. Like us, man. We'll talk shit, right? We might even say, man, goddamn, I can't stand white people. Right. But we don't really, we don't mean it like white people mean it when they talk about us. They really don't yeah, like us, really dog. Like you know what I'm saying? Because we like most of the most forgiving. Forgive me, I know. I knew ever, you bro. was going to say that. We like we the forgive, like we forgot about all the shit that happened 300 years ago. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Shit happened, bro. And I know them people ain't the same people, but some of them people have the same views. You feel yeah, me? for sure. So they really think about that shit. They get that shit running down and through their family bloodline. You know what I'm talking about? Nah, so, no doubt. So, I mean, that shit, man, that shit is crazy, bro. Like. And people don't see this shit, bro. But this shit is fucking crazy, bro. It is, and, we, and it's about and these to are people crazy. in power. And this shit don't get better, bro. I mean, at some point, it's got to, right? Right. I mean, I know you locked the door. No. <laughs> the door open. It's open. <laughs> we got we got company in the studio. I guess they ain't know the door was open. All right, we yeah. All right, we good. Yeah. D will. Not D will. Oh, we about we about to get robbed. <laughs> People We're about like, to get robbed in the, in the studio. We don't even know who it is. The motherfucker ain't came down the stairs yet. Hey, come on, <laughs> whip this motherfucker out on this. Hey, no, we, we about to get robbed live on the air and shit. Like, whip this motherfucker somebody out. Somebody just came in unannounced. And I ain't talking about my penis. <laughs> and he coming down also. that has got to be angry, man. Yes. <laughs> I knew it. Shit. What up, bro? Coming down like Jason Voorhees. All right, for real, for real. Dog, nah, you said because we, we hate specific white people. This is true. This, this is true. true. Like this Donald true. Trump. Yeah. yeah. Can we say that though? Because we live on the air. Can I mean, I said it before on the show before the show started. So I mean, right? Because they, they already heard <laughs> they you. Already obviously, heard me, obviously, you know for what sure. Mean? But it's certain ones. I got a couple. Like I said, I'm gonna do like the white people. You know what I mean? I got a couple white best friends. You know what I mean? <laughs> right. But like, I'm, I'm not racist. I'm not racist. I got white friends. But it's just a lot of them, bro, that won't catch on the message that fucking racism yeah. is supposed to be dead. You know supposed to be. Supposed Sound to be. good. Yeah. But no, that shit crazy though. Angry man, you hear about that shit? Down in Mississippi, the uh, I, I think she was running for the Senate. Uh, the white lady who uh, who basically uh, publicly said that she agrees with lynching, and now she's in the Senate. Mm-hmm. And that's and that, this is no different from what we always say. Like, there's so many white people with those views that are in places of power. That's why I don't understand why people can't understand how systematic oppression still exists <laughs> because those those people. <laughs> <laughs> no, all right. You said Jim was knocking on y'all though. Yeah, man. I, I, better, I better stop talking shit about them right. motherfuckers. But they be knocking on my door for real and shit. <laughs> man, they ain't bullshit. You know, they, yeah, yeah, they out here. So, uh, uh, I just talk about lynching in general. That it's not a bad idea, basically. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I, it's nothing new though. But I guess people people get up in arms when you when you hear it again. But like we know this shit already. Yeah. Like we know that there's people in power that really feel like that. That's why That's shit. Right, right. Because they because they all ninety, so they back from them days. Yeah, them niggas ain't dead. <laughs> yeah, she just said it. Right, exactly. That's what I'm saying. So, but it, it's still it's still fucked up though. And to me, honestly, dog. Again, I said this shit earlier. I think Mississippi is still one of the places where I'm I'm cool with. Yeah. If I never have to go to that bitch in my life, I went. We had a day way, we'll still be good. Yeah, still good. Right, exactly. Right. So my I'm thing cool is, with. like, I've been to Mississippi, dog. It's a beautiful place, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Like, yeah. that motherfucker is beautiful, bro. Like the stars, you feel like you can just run, jump up and grab them. Oh yeah, because it's country. Yeah. So, so yeah. I mean, it's a beautiful place, but some of the people, man, some of the people still stuck that in glitter and gold. You feel yeah. me? Yeah. Some of that shit just weird, dog. Like I said, we we probably never uh, understand. 
because we we from up north. You know north. what I'm saying? We northerns. Right. All right, she said she inboxed me the song. All right, bet. Good looking out. Um, all right, so let, let's talk about something else. Yeah, I don't want to talk about that shit. So we already we already then basically got our jobs lost and let's shit by talking shit. Subject, you ready to get on the subject? Let's you ready? Oh fuck it! All right. I'm about to light this prop blunt. Light this prop blunt. All right. Wake and Bake Show, you know what it is, man. E Block Radio. If y'all just now checking in, man, on IG Live or if you're on Facebook Live or on uh, what's the other shit? Uh, YouTube. Yeah, if you're on YouTube Live, we get ready to talk some shit, man. So today's topic, uh, E Wayne, if you can be fucking patient and shit, uh, <laughs> the topic is should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? All right, so this is where this came from. Uh, D Will, shout out to my man D Will, sent me this. Uh, Send me this link, which was actually DL Hughley's uh, top. Damn, you heard? That don't sound like a prop, my nigga. <laughs> that don't sound like a prop. It's propping my head. <laughs> Shit. Yo, um. Tears coming out my mouth. It was actually DL Hughley's uh, topic. I believe it was yesterday. But uh, Tony Braxton said something about it. She said that, that dudes is like the new bitches now. This is what she said. Man. So she said because I guess she had to pay alimony or some shit <laughs> after a divorce. Yeah. So that that's what we want to know right now. We want to know should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce, man? We had a, obviously we had a conversation beforehand, and y'all uh y'all probably already heard that conversation. But fuck it, let's get into it anyway. More money, dog. Huh. What'd you say, bro? Alimony Hell after yeah, divorce. Yeah, they should pay that shit <laughs> off rip. Off rip. Hell yeah, yeah they should pay it, bro. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like for real, for real, like. If you marry me, that's what people need to be, you know what I'm saying, knowing who the fuck they with. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If you knew who you was marrying, you probably wouldn't have had this issue. If you knew, you know what I'm saying, like really got into knowing the motherfucker, yeah. then you wouldn't have these motherfucking issues. You probably wouldn't even be getting divorced. But. <laughs> he said, if you knew that part, yeah, you probably you wouldn't even be getting divorced. Yeah, you probably wouldn't even made it to that far. But my thing is, <coughs> yes, bro. Like, yeah. if we accumulate money together, bro, and you have the bulk of it. Why not? Ain't no fun when the rapper got the gun. These women all the time go in a relationship just for those reasons. Look for men with money, da 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 da, yeah. da this and this and that. Okay, shit, fuck it. If, if we get a divorce, fuck it. At right. least get half of this shit. Now, see, now, now, Tori, what up, though? My man, Tori, uh, just checked in. Uh, yo, he say under the right conditions. Yes. All right, so he, he, so you agree with that? Uh, definitely under the right okay. conditions, you know what I'm saying? Yo, he ain't saying why not. Well, I'm serious. <laughs> like, why, why the fuck <laughs> 2G not? says a lot of Mitches out here. Yeah. Look, look but, I, go ahead. But this Tony Braxton, man. Tony Braxton saying. Because what about, what about uh, Mary J. Blige? I was about to say. This was, okay, probably, go, ahead, go ahead, go ahead. To. Go ahead. Like, like, I mean, what do you expect? Like, you didn't learn from Mary J. Blige? Yeah. Like, dude came in the fucking relationship. Halfway broke, you was rich. Yeah. So what the fuck you think was gonna happen? Like, come on, bro, they doing this to women now. You know what yeah. I mean? And I, me, me personally, I'm happy about it. I know some people like, about that man, shit. he need to get off and do it on his own. Da, 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 da. No, man. Like those women say, they used to live in a certain lifestyle, right? And now that we divorced, I can't stop my lifestyle. <laughs> Just because <laughs> me like you ain't bitch, together, guys. that's what I'm, that's what the bitches do. <laughs> that's what the bitches do. The bitches so do. that's what you want to do. Hell yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Should I tell you, I'm gonna I'm uh, send you my uh, email address in a minute, right after the show. Uh, Wait, you know, you know my loyalty is royalty, but not for you. Just checked in. What up, though? DJ E Quad just checked in. What up, though? DJ E Quad in the building. Uh, the wreck. What did it say? The wreck. The wreck is stone. What up, though? Anyway, yeah, so right. angry man, you just gonna ready to say something? To to sustain the uh the lifestyle. Stay in the relationship then. <laughs> he said stay in the relationship then. Real talk. Yeah, other than Big, that, man, what the fuck is the point of that shit? Yeah. I mean, I, why was alimony even created? Like for for me, like honestly, what is the purpose of it? to to sustain the lifestyle, like stay what? In the relationship. <laughs> so so if you don't stay in the relationship, then fuck what your lifestyle was. Yeah, huh? Hell yeah, because it say definitely. Yeah. Oh, right? my nigga. Is that not what it's saying? Oh, shit, we got, some, we got some sweet shit from motherfucking Starbucks. Starbucks, cuz brought us some Starbucks, Hell yo. yeah, good looking, dog. Starbucks, y'all gonna pay us, though, for this Hell no, I don't even want to put this motherfucker up there, dog. But I'm gonna drink it. <laughs> right, I'm, yeah, I'm about to drink this <laughs> motherfucker, too. Motherfucker. Uh, the topic today, my bad, if you just checking in on, uh, on IG, man, the topic today is, uh, should women have to pay, uh, I was about to say child support, uh, alimony. Yes, that too. <laughs> yeah, but should women have to pay alimony after a divorce? That's what we want to know. Crimson Rose 7 just checked in. What up, though? 
I mean, I mean, straight up though. Like you just mentioned child support. It's women out here playing child. Well, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna get on that because that's that's different. No, that's how? different. That's different. I, that that I agree. Like if you got if you got kids and you got to if 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 she the breadwinner, she making the most money. Then I agree. Child support is a little bit different. You shouldn't have to support me though. No. Like take care of our kids. But you shouldn't have to support me. So Man, I, I'm, not I'm not in agreement. I'm not in agreement on women that. that. I don't want no motherfucking alimony. If I ain't got a penny, I don't want this bitch cutting me a check every week like I ain't Man, shit. Child, but half of the child support, half the child support <laughs> goes to the motherfucking <laughs> in your windows and bars and shit like that, bro. So I don't know what the fuck you talking about. And this bitch Dooley and Burke was probably bought off my motherfucking yeah. child support. Yeah, yeah, nigga, you ain't had to do child support, so you really don't fucking know. My child support <laughs> supposed to go to the motherfucking child, <laughs> not to a motherfucking Dooley and Burke, bitch. I'm not- <laughs> What you talking about? You talking about we about to we about to for a bunch of time. This nigga that lost his mind. What the fuck? <laughs> the fuck? You talking about some? Yes, the yeah. So look, look, look. I, I'm in, I'm in agreement with child support, bro. That's different. Oh, oh child dude. support is different, dog. I'm in agreement with that. But alimony, dude, I'm straight. Like if I'm broke, if I ain't got a fucking penny, I don't want this bitch cutting me a check every motherfucking month. Like I can't get it myself. So you sound gay. How the fuck I sound gay? What the fuck? fuck you mean? You always get oh, that cool. shit together. No Save me some though. Yeah, I'll give yeah. Him, I, I want all that white shit when I'm doing the show and shit. Oh, hell no. <laughs> right. This nigga already said I'm sounding like a fag and shit. <laughs> no, what the fuck though? I don't, I don't get it though. For real, for real. Like, how the fuck is that gay? Because I don't want your couple dollars. Bitch, if we got kids, take care of my kids and shit. I'm going to go get mine. I'm going to get mad. Or, or, or get me another rich bitch. <laughs> I'm going to get mad in her so I can stay rich. <laughs> What the fuck is you talking about? Like, she going to continue because she going to continue doing first, shows. First of all, this this. I ain't doing shows. I was just the support. So for all my support over the years, I get fucking nothing. Fuck you mean. First, yeah, of, right. all, first of all, is this, though. Just talk to me. If you, if you in that situation and shit, right, you need to be working on your own shit anyway. So if the bitch do leave, you nigga, you got yours. Just like. If you put all your eggs in one basket, like, I'm going to manage this bitch for the rest of my life and never do nothing else. And then when she leave me, I ain't got shit. That's your fuck, my nigga. That's no, not. it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Well, it's fuck yes, Look it at Mary J. Blige. Husband. You just explained the whole Mary J. Blige thing. He was just the fucking manager. Yeah, he, he was. A, he he should have had some other shit to do. Yeah, and he didn't. So that's his. He had other people to manage. She wouldn't let him manage other people at first. You're right though. She wouldn't let him manage you're, you're no right, women, no right, nothing, she no did, didn't. She, she did cut that, that shit off. She did so he say couldn't that. do shit but manage her and do yeah, her thing. So right. let her do her thing, and that's fine. But yeah. bitch, when you want to leave me, that's still his I won't have. There's consequences to this shit. I don't think. I don't think you can compare celebrities. This shit good as hell. Yeah, this Brady. shit is good. Enough. Huh? I don't think you can compare celebrity lifestyle to Pookie and Ray Ray. Because <laughs> Pookie and Ray Ray ain't got shit. Because Mary J's and the Halle Berry's, they wanted to marry a dude yeah. that wasn't a celebrity to have a kind of a basic normal life. <laughs> and keep them, for real, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, no, I'm a celebrity. They wanted to marry that dude. Then when they when they go their separate ways, now I couldn't come up because you wanted me to be a regular dude. So now if you make it 20 million a year and I couldn't get my, you know, like my hustle on through your career or whatever it was that I was doing. Because, because you was controlling it. Then when you leave, yeah. Did not need that. Nah. No. If you talk so that's about, like Mary J. You're husband. About Keisha and Joe. <laughs> Keisha and corner, Joe. Dang. Then I don't think Joe should get because I don't because I think Joe should have been hustling the whole time he was with Keisha. But, but my thing is simple. Celebrity, simple. Celebrities and, and regular everyday people. I think it's different. celebrities and regular people is different. But also I think that the the constant in that is the is the controlling bitch man. I ain't no, trying no, to be my, funny, no, but. My thing is if a chick controlling that shit, then you might be in a position where he couldn't sign. He couldn't her do shit because he trying to be faithful to her uh, and to her idea. I'm gonna give you shit. another one, Kiki you know Wyatt and her husband. You know he can't do shit. Didn't mean to cut you off, but you know what? what that, that still falls back on the dude. You know what I'm saying? Be a motherfucking man. Be a man. Uh. You know what I'm saying? My <laughs> thing is this, and, and, I, and hear me out. If I go into this and you telling me what, ain't no woman gonna fucking tell me what the fuck I can and can't do for a living. Right. You just, I, that's just me. You, I don't give. If I got you. Obviously, I'm in this status. I'll go to the next celebrity business. <laughs> right. But you're not going to tell me as a grown man what the fuck I can and can't do to make a living. Dude. That's just me being a fucking man. I don't care if it's Keisha around the corner. 
Or Keisha Cole. <laughs> Keisha around the corner or Keisha Cole. Right. Yo, as a man, no, fuck you. No. Just because of this reason here. Yeah. My thing is, I don't give a fuck if my wife makes more than me. I'm always going to be able to support myself if you leave me. Yeah. And definitely. I'm going to maintain my own lifestyle All right. if you leave me. Right. So my thing is, like I said, if I'm in that status to pull Mary J. Blige, I can pull the next motherfucking uh, celebrity bitch. Right. For real. And, you know, and I agree. Me. You're not dictating shit to me. I, I agree. And, that, I and agree. that's why that's I, what agree, I said. I agree, too, to the and, point. And that's why I said that, that it's cool because kid, kids do get... Uh, you know, they do get acclimated to a certain to a certain motherfucking living. I think child support completely different. Yeah. Exactly. That's so a whole, that's, that's a whole, that's a whole different. Different. exactly. Yeah. So that's why I said kids do that. So take care of them motherfuckers. Like if we split up, then yeah, yes, bitch, you need to you need to pay me some child support. I'll take that, but I don't want no alimony, y'all. And I manage you. You're not gonna tell me who the fuck else I can and can't marry. You're not gonna. Do, do, do. I, okay, look. Okay, well, bitch, you only <laughs> fuck an album. You just gonna have a single every fucking year. <laughs> so you gonna have a single. You dictating my career. I'm dictating yours. Yeah. You ain't gonna Yo. tell me what the fuck to do. Sony just checked in. What up, though? Hope them finals went good, baby. Yeah. Good uh, luck, she man. said. She said the same chick who paying alimony is the lady that proposed. I ain't paying. <laughs> she <laughs> said, yeah, no. Nah, moral support is free. Move around, bro. Fuck yeah. that. Uh, my loyalty is royalty. You know that that your name is too long. You got uh, type in your real name so we. I gotta read that whole shit. But uh, she said, no, nope, especially if the guy just married her for the money. That's different. If the, if the dude yeah, just married yeah, her for the yeah. money, then yeah, I get it. Like it some goes, situations. Right. She said, it goes both ways as well if his female only wanted the guy for his money. That, that's true. It like, should, but it don't. Right, yeah, I know. It don't and that's why that. I'm angry. And that's why I say, fuck yeah, we deserve it. Because y'all right. been getting it all this goddamn time. Miriam just checked in again. What up, though? Miriam is a fan now. Thank you for checking us out, baby. Appreciate you, Miriam. I think you got to look at the times, man. Can I chime in here? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. This shit I mean, is this 30, shit is 40, good. It is 30, 40, 40, 40, 50 years ago. Yeah. Moms were staying at the crib. Yeah. Moms couldn't do anything. Women's right. rights wasn't the same. They couldn't. Today, chicks like I ain't cooking nothing. Right. You stay at home with the kids. We gonna split this thing up and down the middle. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So then I understood alimony, and I think that's what. Of course, your good dude's gonna say no. Nah, I'm a man, this and that, and then yeah. we're just gonna grandstand and try to be. You know what I'm saying? Try yeah. to try to use it as an excuse. Right. But today. Where women are shoot, women get opportunities that we can't get. And so Shit, you know hell yeah. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm not. Uh -oh. I'm not supporting his view. But, what I, I'm but you is, ain't supporting it. But it's going right saying, to it though. <laughs> what I'm saying is, alimony was a different beast back then. Whereas today, now it's like I agree with what Angry Man was saying. Get rid of it. Period. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? just get rid of the whole you know, shit. You can set your foot on the same ground that I was on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, then, and then if we do leave, and and my woman wasn't working, and we have kids, then child support is a different. Just like if I take the kids and you making more money than me, yeah, I'm gonna need that child support. Yeah, the kids, go, they the got kids. two incomes. Exactly, I can't, I can't provide that and lifestyle. They all in private school and shit. But yeah. I think it was a different time. Yeah, and I think a lot of those laws and stuff that's on the court, some of those things they outdated. It's step from that shit, yeah. right? Just like, just like every other fucking law, <laughs> right. <laughs> right? Just like every other law. But come on, man, y'all be, y man, what's up with the equal shit? Y'all want them? All, everybody want? They want to be equal, right? <laughs> right? Okay. Do they want to be equal, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So okay. If, if you equal to me. You deserve the same punishment I get, goddammit. <laughs> That's punishment? Yes! <laughs> Alimony is punishment! <laughs> you know, Shit! You know, you, but you have a point, but you know, like I said, you know, I'm always. <laughs> you said a punishment. Thing. But the thing is, I wouldn't even let the shit get that fucking far. You, but I'm just saying, like, if, in that situation, yeah, period, bro. I can do better. Hell so yeah, that's what they say. <laughs> stick, <laughs> stick to that shit. These motherfuckers, <laughs> these motherfuckers <laughs> burn their bras. He, got a point, he say, he say, he say, shit changed from the 30s because it has. Because mama was only job was to cook, take clean, house. take care of the house, and make sure we good. Yeah. And pops would just bring her home the bacon. You right. feel me? So now, your your job better than motherfucking mine. Right. You making more money than me now. Definitely a possibility. So why in the fuck I don't deserve the same shit? Okay, some of you dudes, I understand. Y'all saying, yeah, I'm a man. I'm a motherfucker. Get on my motherfucker home. No. No. <laughs> no, me <laughs> personally. Me, no. no. Equal rights. I'm going to get on my own, but I'm going to get yours too, just like you would have did me. All it's right, the role in right, reverse. So right. we equal, motherfucker. All right, so so Wednesday. We equal. You burnt your bra. <laughs> 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 this motherfucker man. Look, so Wednesday, uh -huh. I said if you had a daughter mm -hmm. and she wanted to propose to her dude and shit, you wasn't having that shit, right? No. Now, what's going to happen with that same dude and shit? 
He leave her and he want alimony. You go tell her that, hey, you got to pay it, baby. You got to pay it, baby. Yeah, right. Shit. You go, man. So you don't want your daughter to propose to a nigga, but you nope. want her to pay alimony. Why? Well, she going to have to. Well, tell you. The fuck know. you mean? She going to have to. Know, Yo, they birthday bras, bro. You sound like These a wishy-washy politician. Wishy-washy. You got that right, wishy-washy. These bitches play football with niggas. I seen football girls. Man, you can't tell me. Y'all want to be hey, equal. you supposed to drink this shit that fast, are you? Yo, this shit is mad good, Damn, though. Damn, nigga, you want to be equal, right? <laughs> My bad. You want to be equal, right? They equal, right? I, yeah. They have equal rights, right? Yeah, So supposedly. they equal to what you, you, right? Yeah. So if you do something... Like, I, if you go in the store... I gotta pay. You go in the store and rob the motherfucking store, right? Uh, you say, really? we give me your money. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then you fucking go. She come with you. Yeah. Right behind you, rob the same fucking store. You get the motherfucking shit. Y'all supposed to get the same time. Miriam said equality. I guess she agree with you. Uh, oh my god, I can't. I can't believe. First of all, I can't believe it's, it's women out here that agree with you. It's real tough. Yo, hit, hit me in the hit me in the uh, comment box right now, man. We want to know should women have to pay alimony after These divorce? These motherfuckers man? make more than us. Just because of what you told them, they got sons now that's getting money. Yeah, they got sons getting money out yeah, here. Yeah. So they agree or not, shit. Uh, yeah. I don't know, man. Hit me in the, uh, on the IG comments, man, or on the Facebook comments. Let us know what you think. Should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? So, Monk Money, just in case you just uh, chiming in right now. Monk Money say hell to the year. He won his check and shit. Uh, <laughs> Angry Man yeah. said, uh, he, he's like, he go, he go get out the situation before this shit even get to that. But he said, if you want to keep that money flowing and shit, stay in the marriage, right? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Uh, D. Will say that shit, the, the laws didn't change, so maybe that's why the shit is like it is. But child support is a different thing, so child support most definitely alimony, man, not so much. So right now, it look like in, in the studio, Monk Money the only one that wants that check every week. So ladies, if y'all if y'all rich, have Monk Money back on the market. Yeah. Don't marry that Monk Money. Hey, hey. <laughs> He going to take your check, I'm baby. I'm taking half of that bag, baby. <laughs> take a half, I'm God damn. Oh, you ain't got to give me a half. I don't even want him to have. I just, the whole point. Uh -huh. It's pretty good. The way you just went over. Yeah, the yeah. Kind of oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Harvey level stuff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, do, I do this shit a, real, a little bit. Right. Sarita just checked in. What up, though? She said, yes, why not? I want my money. Yeah. All right, so, so damn, Thank the you. ladies agree the ladies, with you. for sure. Oh, okay. I'm trying to tell you it's what it is. Shout out to La La Lasanji Hill. Did I say that right? Lasanji Hill. What up, though? Say a real man uh, wouldn't want anything from a woman. All right, see, that's what I say. That's what she said. She probably got it for her great great grandma still alive because she was <laughs> and stealing shit in it. I understand that. This but my thing is. Her great great grandma <laughs> is stealing shit in it. <laughs> <coughs> my thing is, though, I can understand. I'm a yeah, man. I'm a man. I'm with you. I'm a man. Trust me. But trust you, still, you still want your check. I still want my check. <laughs> <laughs> you won't have you burnt your bras. You equal to me. We the same. Like said, you, got a point. you the same. You burnt your bra. You so you deserve this. You get what you deserve, yeah. right? Y'all, y'all have all these women empowerment movements. Women and this and that. Women and this and that. And women do you this. Say all that women shit with a deep voice, though. Yeah. <laughs> all that women and this and right. that. You Burning the bras. Burning your bras and shit. <laughs> y'all want equal rights? Yeah, y'all gonna get the equal punishment is just as well as I am. You know what I'm saying? So I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't, sorry, right. sorry. T T, what up, though? <laughs> Chase yeah. West just checked in. What up, baby? That, that real men don't want for women. That definition has changed. Yeah, the whole definition of all yeah. that shit changed. Yeah, everything changed. But dude, I'm just saying, if y'all just now, if y'all just uh, check it. <laughs> No, little girl, go to work. <laughs> anyway, man, uh, if y'all just checked it on IG, man, we talking right now. We trying to figure out should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce, man? I say, I say hell to the law because I just I don't want it. If we got kids, take care of our kids, man. Don't be cutting me the check. Like that's I feel I don't I don't feel right with that shit, bro. I don't know. Cut me the check. I had to deal with your fart ass and you waking up in the morning smelling your motherfucking breath. Are you just a, just what? A, so you want to get paid for smelling everything. Fart? Everything. I don't care what y'all say. I think like Star more support. I think the Starbucks is kicking more in. More support. Like, huh? Smelling your breath. Yo, helping you take hey, the hey, kids. Hey, time out though, D. Will. What the fuck is this? It's a latte. This, it's a latte or some shit. White, White chocolate, chocolate mocha. mocha. I feel, now, now I feel gay as fuck. This is I feel gay as hell. This shit is great though. Yeah. White mocha <laughs> chocolate from Starbucks. I don't even drink coffee for it. This shit is great. It but is. um, yeah. So you say fuck that. You've been smelling breath and farts and shit. So now you want to check. That makes sense. I get it. Yeah, I get that shit. I don't, nigga. Fuck that. I, I don't want the check. I want it. 
cut me that bitch. Now what if now now what if you in a situation and you you had your little side hustle or whatever you had going on and you making your own money, you still want the check? No, that's what I'm saying. Like, sir, I said, so, sir, so situation, if you ain't got bro. it, that's what sir, situation, okay. bro. Is don't put yourself in a position. Where <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was what I said. Like, don't don't put yourself in a but position. But if y'all where... agree for him to be in this certain situation, she want him. To be in this certain situation, oh, yeah, like, she like, going Mary J. Blige situation. Yeah, no, run yeah. That. Then, run that. you gonna pay me? <laughs> no, run that. Yeah, you gonna make me just manage you? Yeah, you gonna well, that's because well, you gotta me. control the bitch anyway. That's, that's a whole me. other problem. I want run my that. bag. I'm in that bag with you, baby. <laughs> so you fuck that. With you. If we divorcing. Uh, you was banging another dude. Oh, that, yeah. I want that check. You want that check? If <laughs> you smashing another nigga, I want that Come check. Come on, y'all yeah, niggas. Right. Now y'all niggas feeling me. Yeah. Now y'all feeling me. I mean, yes. Cir- circumstance. No circumstances. I mean, if you banging a dude, yes, I want that check. But if we just growing apart, then I mean, bitch gone. Oh, that's that's. What Take I'm, care of my kids. So that's what I'm saying. So you ain't greased with me now. Steve what? Harvey, when you know, <laughs> <laughs> what? I gotta, no, nigga, I'm saying what? that there are circumstances, but I mainly I don't want it. Like, cause I, I guess I'm who saying I'm, like, I'm saying that, I'm saying that because I ain't gonna ever put myself in that position right. where I'm only in this bitch. Bag. But I'm talking for the like, dude that's in that position. Yeah, because okay. if I'm in that position and you say you, I can't do shit but be up under your ass all day and you make the bag. Oh, yeah, right you then yeah, you gotta that. run that. Dude. I want well, that. First of all, I ain't I even leaving. That. I'm not even know. leaving. I'm I'm yeah. stabbing on your ass. Hey, you <laughs> only way I'm gonna leave you. I'm stabbing it over on your ass. Only way you gonna leave? I'm gonna leave is you shoot me. Bitch, right. and I die. And that's the only way I'm Ben Jones just checked in with no, Shout out to the Puff Puff Pass Poetry, man. Shout out to my man, Ben that's Jones. That's This nigga's ain't gonna pump gas or something. Take out the garbage and cook. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hell yeah. Fuck that. Whatever the fuck. Because look, because standing like a motherfucking lawyer or some shit, right? He getting money. Like, he ain't getting over money, but he getting money. So, and he just, he chilling. Shit, that's what I'm gonna do. Fuck the alimony. I ain't leaving. I'm just gonna stick around. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure. You wouldn't even know who the heck a statement was. Hell no, nah, you're right. There's right. a lot of lawyers out here. Yeah, there's a lot of lawyers, huh? Duh, so if y'all just now checking in on IG Live, man, we're talking about today, should a woman have to pay alimony after a divorce, man? That's what we want to know. Hit me in the comment box on IG Live or on Facebook Live. Again, man, my man Mump Money say, fuck that, cut the check. I'm in the bag, <laughs> baby. Put me in hey, the bag. Angry man sort of in, in a grid, so if, if the circumstance is right. right? Circumstance. So if she controlling the bag, like, you can't do shit else but work on her projects and shit, and then y'all break up, right, you man. want them couple dollars. But, and then, but Give then me I the money. Back and yeah. say, I wouldn't put myself in that exactly, I wouldn't put myself in that position, and, and, that, and that's all I'm saying. Right, for sure. D. Will said if she out there throwing it back on a nigga, he definitely, he definitely want that. Bitch, back. I want the check. Yeah. <laughs> you want the check? You, you did this. You did this. <laughs> Serena say, okay, then. <laughs> Until death do us part. Yeah, Until <laughs> death, death, <laughs> death, death. Right. Oh, so you dead, dead, uh. you dead, dead. No, no. So I, I don't know though. It, it really had to be. It had to be that extreme. Like I gotta catch her fucking somebody. Certain situations, I want. Or she gotta be super we, controlling. And she fucking with. Because if 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 mom, some, yeah, if certain mom. situations fuck up and I fuck up in the in the relationship, I can't do nothing but take that take that take that, take yeah. that blow. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you women need to take it too. Yeah. Like y'all burnt y'all broke for this shit, man. You not gonna let that Hell shit go. Hell no, on. y'all want equal rights. Y'all get the equal everything equal. Then everything should be equal. Yeah. Everything should some, be. Some of you say, well, if he wanted my money, he should have never got divorced, <laughs> right? We we say that. Yeah. If I make the money, I make. Oh shit, she said, if I make the money, I make the rules. Nigga. Now he got to deal with it, and I'm allowed to. Nigga, what? what? Damn, so she is. So you got you. Damn, ready, so you you usually be on my money side. I don't, I don't so know. So got her a puppy or something. She talking about. She ain't talking about no man. <laughs> she, 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 talking about <laughs> she talking about the puppy. Yeah, yeah. Right. She got that brilliant. Yeah. She got that platinum card. Ain't nobody giving me no rules. Hell no, no, she no said rules. I make the rules. You can't get no Damn. Man no rules. If you can do that, then so I ain't mad at you either. I ain't mad at you. If you can do that, yeah. then uh. <laughs> yeah. Then go ahead. Uh, my man Ben John said they leave us more than we leave them. He said leave that bag. I won. <laughs> no, so you want the bag too? Everybody yeah. want the bag? Huh? Yeah. I don't know. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. Lasanji said uh, it's called a prenuptial agreement. You leave out with what you came in with. I'm just saying some women want a man so bad they would take in anything. 
they, this is true too. You got this some women who who really is like they they check chases, like they really get money, and then they fuck around and just fuck with like the wrong dude. You, ever you the gotta have you yeah. gotta fuck with somebody with at least equal ambition though. Like you uh, ever see those gold digging skits on fucking Facebook? Yo, that shit is real, bro. That shit is fucking real, shit? bro. The dude pull up in a bucket. They like, oh, I ain't fucking with you. Then he walk over to the Lambo. They like, oh shit, you know I ain't got no boyfriend yeah, for real. Yeah, fuck nah, that, that shit, man. That, that shit is real be, life, yeah. bro. That shit real that life. That shit bro. real life, bro. So you out here lurking like a fucking shark. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you these bitches get like rid of the whole shit. Yeah. yeah, throw the whole shit in the trash. Yeah, then, then, <laughs> it, it, it should be like you know a prenup without it, the shit being on paper. Yeah. yeah. Once you get divorced, you ain't come in with nothing. You gonna, they gonna leave shit. with it. Right. So, so basically, it should be the other way around. Like when you get into a marriage, then you should have to sign paperwork to agree. To split half shit. But if we work in the you know together and get this back. Like, so if you don't if you don't sign that paper, then automatically you leave you leave out with what you came in with. No, no, fuck half. We gonna work on the percentage. Why why half? Well, why I'm just saying, saying, just whatever, whatever the case may be. Like so I'm just saying, like if you reverse the shit, instead of doing a prenup to 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 no, save that, yourself. No, that should be up to the person with the wealth. That should be up to that person to decide. Yeah. Okay, when I divorce you, now I don't wanna put no shit on paper. Because uh -huh. I might change my mind on the percentage. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, when, when we divorce, I should have the option to say, okay, that nigga say can, when. She can have this. She can have that. Serena says she a baby shark. You know, she can have this. <laughs> she can have that. Yeah. I don't want to put the shit on paper saying, okay, she get half, and then this bitch did some old outlandish shit. But now on paper, she's supposed to get half anyway. You know, yeah. You no, know, it should be at the point of divorce. You know what yeah. I mean? It's like, okay, she can get this, or this bitch gets nothing. Right. Period. Or vice versa. Like, bitch can say this nigga don't deserve shit, so he yeah. ain't getting shit. See, this is situation like shit. Situation like take care of my kids. We get in together. We get in to come together. We ain't got uh -huh. shit. Both yeah. of us. Then we start getting the bag together. That's, 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 that's a that's a business agreement at that point. Well, yeah, shit. I guess I mean, marriage is anyway. Marriage. That's what the fuck. That's what the fuck it is yeah, anyway, that's what right? The fuck yeah. it is. So we get in the bag together. Then that's to be a perfect split, bro. You take your half. I take my half. We, we keep doing our thing. I yeah. get the fuck out. Right. But these women. They go above and beyond, bro. Like uh, they, they so fucking extra. What about this though, right? I know this is uh, I know this is fictional. Some of them. But what about uh? I won't say all you what was the name of that shit? Uh, why did I get married? I think this was part two and shit. Mm -hmm. Right when when uh Janet and motherfucking Malik Yoba and shit broke up, and uh, they was split. They split everything, but then that nigga wanted all the residuals from her book sales and shit. Yeah, what about shit like that? That's, that's some whole ass that's shit gay. though. That's gay as fuck, right? Because that's her shit. He ain't yeah, had nothing to do with shit. that. That's her but, shit. Then, but then the way he explained it, though, is that her books would have never happened if he wasn't the motherfucking research specimen. That's so, true, too. So, I that's still think too. that was weak as fuck, though. I still think it's weak as fuck, but yeah. he has a point, bro. He do got a point, though, because she wouldn't have had the material if Hell he wasn't no. there. Hell no. Hell yeah. no. That's just Tyler Perry trying to be the only good guy in the movie, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah Tyler Perry. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 He always got the temptations. Don't never put none of his bullshit out there. Yo, shout out to my man Bo. That nigga said I had to check you out on I had to check you out on here because on IG I couldn't see nothing but the side of your head. <laughs> I know my beard is motherfucking tight though, but uh, anyway, <laughs> motherfucking beard gang in this bitch beard gang, cuz. But um, yeah, so I, I think shit like that. I think somehow sometimes niggas go over over the top. Like he was already getting half, but then the the book sales. I don't know. So like I, I guess specifically though, does it matter? Does it really matter? Like where the money is coming from for you? Like because you said you want the check regardless. So no, like I don't say I'm not saying regardless, bro. I'm I saying mean, some situations, bro. Yeah. Like a lot of situations, yes, I'll deserve the bag, bro. Yeah. Like in situations where like like I just said, when fucking women we get the we ain't had shit, we came up together, then okay. That's that's a different fucking story. Yeah. But if I'm getting the bag and you come in, you jump on the bandwagon and I'm getting it, you just jump on the bandwagon, yeah. then shit you don't deserve half. Yeah. You can get your little twenty percent, okay, bam. Oh, you can get ten percent, I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah. But Damn. <laughs> but I'm just saying though. Shit. I'm just saying though. Like, and, and baby girl say explain extra. Like that. This is what I'm saying. Like the gold digger shit. Y'all yeah. look for motherfuckers out here with money. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he, yeah. So, yeah Y'all so have to have actually. certain requirements. They got a whole list what the nigga's supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? Not her list next to his, but what just his list. What right. I supposed to be. What he supposed to do. What he supposed to have. And he's supposed to do this. And yeah. he's supposed to do that. The fuck you do. <laughs> but you want half yeah. on the way out? Nigga, fuck that. You got me fucked up. So if the situation reversed and she get in the bag and I jump in the bandwagon, I want my 20%. You yeah, you want your right. 20%. Hell yeah, I ain't got to have half, but I want something. 
Oh, uh, my bad, Serena. I'm sorry. <laughs> he said, I said, no, I'm not a baby shark. He said, mm. I work, but I'm but I'm working harder than, than my man. That's crazy to me. Oh, shit. You ain't just going to put that to go blast like that, are you? Oh, <laughs> you ain't just going to put that to go blast on hey, live it TV is, it right now. You don't watch E-Block Radio. <laughs> right. I mean, I hope he do, but damn, I hope he ain't watching right now. <laughs> <laughs> right. Lasagna said, I love the beard. Yes. Oh, shit. All right, then. Shit, you like that motherfucking beard? All right. Thank you, baby. Appreciate the love. Uh, what's uh, where we at? Oh, so you say right, be every on point, like, like who, like Murpha, like Muffa. Oh, Muffa, <laughs> like Muffa. a motherfucker. <laughs> I can't, no, I haven't even got high yet. What the fuck? I know, I, I can't even, I can't even get my shit together. Thank y'all, though. Appreciate the love. My man Soul digging and check this out on uh, on Facebook, too. I guess he got tired of looking at the side of my face. I don't yeah, know, yeah. but um, all right, so see, we got about we got about five minutes left. So just to recap, man, if y'all just now checking in, we talking right now about should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? That's that's what we want to know. We got some difference of opinions right now, but I think we almost to a central area and shit. What is something on there? Somebody say, Monk, Monk, you gonna want this relationship to work? Uh, that's all you should want. He said, if you go, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that's all you should want. So definitely. But I'm just saying, it's, it, it, we're not talking about that. We talking about. <laughs> said, we ain't talking about that. We talking about if the shit goes through motherfucking alimony, sour and alimony. <laughs> right. I want my motherfucking bag just like you would want your bag. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, equal rights. Right? Equal, equal rights. rights. Y'all burnt y'all bras for this, bro. Y'all equal. <laughs> y'all equal to us, bro. Yeah. Hey, look, they like we ain't burn shit. This was our ancestors. Well, shit. They, well, not, they, not, they, not, I mean, our, our previous generation. They damn so reaping the benefits because they make more yeah. than. More than you, motherfucker. Yeah. Half the fucking senate, the senators around this bitches is women. So how much money you think they making? You feel? Uh, I won't say half, but I understand where you are going with it. <laughs> majority half. Ma ma majority is probably old ass white man. This thing is the majority. Yeah, these niggas won't die, but trust me, it's a <laughs> that, chick behind that. That nigga said, "Yep." Yeah. <laughs> he, he was trying to look at the side of my face, man. All right, we go. <laughs> we go fix that, dog. We, my IG shit don't, you know what I'm saying? But it's all right, whatever. But uh, anyway, uh, just to recap again, dog, should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? Like I said, I think we all kind of got a different opinion, but it, it's kind of circulating back to the back to the middle and shit. I, I still I still love what D Will said though, because he said that if she throwing it back on a nigga, he definitely want to check. That one I agree with. If she throwing it back on a nigga, I want to check. But outside of that, that's about the only thing I can think of that would make me want to get an alimony check. Man, fuck Just that. take care of my kids. Like you get money if we got saying. kids. Like take care, take care of my but kids. But once y'all get divorced, she gonna throw it back on a nigga anyway. So once you get the motherfucker say you done, what she gonna throw that motherfucker back on somebody else anyway? Well, no. Yeah, that, that don't matter. I don't care what she do yeah, after I the fact. She fucking while we together. No, that's the problem. The fact. I don't right. I don't give a fuck after. But my thing is though, y'all are equal. Be that way. Be that way. Y'all want no fuck no ain't no man shit they equal right, well, fuck it. they burnt they bras for I'm this a, shit bro I'm gonna treat these and, good and, ass and Starbucks shit should be the same if I get fucked up in the same situation I should be fucked up I should get fucked up if she do it she should be have the same fucked up situation that I'm in Lasanji said that women are never equal to a man so hell no. That's what you saying that, but that ain't what the fucking society say. That ain't what society say. Hell no, that ain't what my fucking <coughs> Michelle Obama woman empowerment movement said. Well, they got all these empowerment movements because they not equal. Oh my Mark god, Mark money. Okay, don't just say it. Okay, that's the whole reason, right? Okay, that's why we. That's why. <laughs> all right. That's why we do it. That's why we do empowerment shit for black people, right? Because okay. we're not equal. Okay. Right, Mark money. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Monk money, yeah, Mister Monk money. You bullshit. <laughs> Am I bullshit? You bullshit. Cause I want that bag, baby. You want that? <laughs> Fuck what you. So you say? I heard Beyonce to the left, to the left. Yeah, bye. Nah, so look, bye. my 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 <laughs> thing is this though. I'm kind of more along the lines with angry with angry man on this one is that if you in a situation where you didn't kind of got, I ain't go. Yeah, I'm gonna use that word. You done got trapped <laughs> into your little situation because you can't get a bag without her because of whatever circumstance she put you in. Then I think that you need to just go ahead and fight it out and stay. Like you just get you a side bitch and just roll it out and keep on making this money. Cause like, what's the point? Like I, I'm not gonna leave this bitch if she she fucking around, but but the bag secure with us together. That's like that right? So right? So. If, if it's my fault and I let myself be in that situation, I'm just going to stay in the situation. And I'm going to just go fuck with hoes on the side. I, that, I mean, that's just really what I'm going to do. I'm, do yeah, I'm going to be 100 with you. Like, I, it's, it's probably a lot of power couples out here that ain't really together. You know what I'm saying? They just together because the business working out. Yep. And that's go, that that would be me. Like, you know what, bitch? I, I'm about to leave. Like, oh, I, I can't get none of that back. 
All right, so bitch, just Keisha. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fuck it. Like, hey, it's bitch, just Keisha. If, if, if you see us out, she the babysitter, bitch, okay? Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, something. I don't, I don't know. Because I'm not about to leave, like, so I, I want to keep on getting... Anyway, dog. Niggas ain't shit, dog. Hey, but they do it, too, <laughs> though. Shit. They do That's it, too. That's what I'm too. saying. They do it, too, though, bro. Like, That's come on, bro. Deal, man. Yeah. yeah, I understand that. And I'm going to get my own money. Yeah. But in certain situations, yeah. where you got a chick, that's controlling. You got a chick yeah. that wants you to do every move where she move and this all this that's shit and all that shit. Then it's a wrap, baby boy. I want my bag. You cut me off from the other world, bitch. And oh. you making the money. I want the money. They were singing the fucking Beyonce song. I know. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. I'm looking, I'm looking at the lyrics. Like, this is a motherfucker. Yeah. Uh, my man Soul Digger say, but in the black community, women are becoming head of households. That is true. True. As, uh, as the and as the breadwinner. So, I kind of agree with Monk. Damn, you agree with Monk? Man, fuck Monk. This nigga ain't winning today. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, it's Friday, nigga. I'm fuck that. I can get a Pink win. Pink Lady 05 just checked in. Whatever, baby. And now and then I can deserve a W because I don't care what's going every now and then. And, then you, and none of y'all can fucking change my mind because they burn their bras. <laughs> Simple as that. Simple as that. You never going no further There's than no that. No further. I don't need to go no further. And y'all can't do. explain it to me no other fucking way. Like I understand what you. Because even if said. they do, you're not gonna take it. No, because <laughs> these motherfuckers, you know, burn. They they equal to us. <laughs> All the air quotes. Uh, they're equal to us. All the air quotes. So in the world. you deserve every equal thing that I do. Everything's supposed to be fucking equal. Down the half, in the middle, equal. Fifty yeah. fifty. Yeah. Down the half. Down the half. <laughs> Pink lady, she just waved to us. Uh, damn, I, I don't know if she's still there. I want her to comment real quick, but we getting ready to go. Look, we're going to go around the block one last time. If you got a couple of comments, you can hit me in the comment box. We got like uh, 30 seconds. But uh, hit me in the comment box. I'll read it live on the air. D. Will, man, one last time, dog. Should a woman have to pay alimony after a divorce? I think, I think a woman should pay alimony if and only if. I have to watch Stafford through this whole contract. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. How the fuck did you sleep? <laughs> that shit That's in there, dog. I didn't, I didn't know. <laughs> How the fuck did he sleep? I knew Matt that. Stafford into this shit. I knew it. I knew something was good. I think everything needs to be changed, man. Like I said, if uh, somebody, if the woman is cheating and that's why you left, also I agree with the point real quick of if the woman is an empire and she wanted you to stay because just like GM, if that's what you was depending on and then they cut you off, they even give you a separate. Give me that bag, right. Yeah, they even give for sure, for sure. I, I, I dig that. I dig that. So we kind of in greens with me a little bit. That's huh? what that sound like. <laughs> I saw this kind of coming back. Yeah. Real quick though, Sonya said women only making seventy nine cents for every dollar that a man make. So boy, bye. Yeah. Girl, boom with your motherfucking <laughs> girl, <statistics>. boom. <laughs> Fuck you talking about? <laughs> you motherfuckers is fucking uh, CEOs L- of companies. you say you supposed to appreciate the sweat from your brow. That means you supposed to be doing all the work. What the Anchorman. fuck you gonna do? Anchorman, Anchor what up? Anchorman, what, what up? You talking about I'm doing all the work? What the fuck you gonna do? Cassandra Bennett just checked in. What up, baby? You know Sit there and reap the benefits. Kiss my ass. You know what? Just get rid of the whole problem. Just get rid of alimony, period. Fuck that. Get rid of the whole problem. Just get rid of marriage. Yeah, that's <laughs> <it>. <laughs> Let's get rid of marriage. Fuck it. Let's just get rid of everything. Just stay out here right. Control. Just sign a contract. Like the extended boyfriend contract. <laughs> we can sign you for three years and shit. <laughs> like a motherfucking staff from joint. Oh, God, God. Like this nigga didn't even work out. Shit, I done paid him all this money. <laughs> Uh, he called the Stafford contract. <laughs> he called the Stafford. <laughs> so then when a nigga complain like, damn, baby, I ain't got no line. <laughs> Turn the show around. Right. Turn the whole show around. <laughs> I got no protection in this motherfucker. Uh, right. G-Dog, Moose, just checked in. What up, though? Yo, we, we, about to, we about to get up out of here, but if you want to hit a comment real quick, dog, should a woman have to pay alimony after the divorce? That's what we talking about right now. Should a woman have to pay alimony after the divorce? Should a woman have to pay alimony Should a woman have to pay alimony after the divorce? That's what we talking about right now. My money. Your close out statement, bro. What's, what's good? Bro. Y'all are equal. Yeah. So if you want to fucking be equal and everything, you deserve the equal shit. Like if something happened to me mm-hmm. and I get the punishment, then okay. And I did. It, you did the same thing. Something happened to you. You deserve the same fucking punishment. 
I don't care what the situation. They keep calling it punishment. Yeah, I don't care what the situation is, bro. Yeah. Like you, you got to roll with the punch. It is what it is. It is like some of these women are fucking CEO of co- a, a large companies. They get in this bed yeah. and they over the man, bro. So right. right then and there, they give you, they give you this empowerment shit. Like old girls say, well, uh, uh, I make all the money. I make all the rules. That's bullshit. Because <laughs> if niggas don't even make all the rules, and they, right? Like, they can't and even we say make that. the money. And we right. can't even say that. So that right there, y'all got so much empowerment behind y'all anyway that y'all don't really need a motherfucking women empowerment movement. All y'all <laughs> need to do that with me. you fucking up now. I don't give a fuck. And then these motherfuckers <laughs> say, oh, 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 well, they supposed to wet and sweat and browse and have sweat and put everything on their back. What the fuck is you doing? What the fuck is you doing while I'm doing all this sweating? You just sitting there watching me sweat? Not even gonna jump in and help a nigga? Fuck out of here. Yeah, this might be the end. This nigga fucked up. Fuck out of here. We already fucked up the LGBTQ, RSTUV and shit. Damn. We on the E. We on the E block. Can Bella just check the end? What up, though? What up? Yo, all right, so, yeah, dog, coffee Starbucks me, is coffee good as me, fuck. Me like this. I ain't gonna lie, dog. All right, so look, we on our way out, dog. We're gonna make one last comment. Uh, Lasanji said, Monk, hush. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so look, what we were talking about today, should a woman have to pay alimony after divorce? I don't necessarily agree that she should have to pay alimony unless, like my man D. Will said, I caught her fucking another dude and shit. Then I, I might want her to cut the check. But in real life, my whole thing is if we got kids together or whatever and we split up, then yes, take care of the kids if you the breadwinner and shit. But outside of that, I really don't even want your bag, dog. I'm going to go get my own, baby. You feel me? But uh, on that note, dog, we about to check up out of here, dog. I want to thank everybody who checked us out today on IG Live, man, on Facebook Live, on YouTube Live. Man, thank y'all for y'all support, dog. We in this bitch three days a, a motherfucking week, bro. Yeah, talk to us. We talk back. For sure, dog. Hey, we hey, having hey, fun hey, in this baby bitch. Baby girl, yeah, bear our kids, yeah. How you get the kid in there? How the kid get in that oh. <laughs> He's not going to let none of this shit go. No. Yo, nah, we all appreciate baby. the appreciate love the beer love, too. You know what I'm saying? Beer gang, you know what I'm saying? Keep bearing our kids, baby. I'm just talking <laughs> shit, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but keep it in 100 at the same goddamn time. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> for sure. Thanks for checking us out, Marion. We about here, though. Dog, till the next time, man. You already know what it is, man. I got my man D Wheel in the building. He all the way over there. He can't hear me. Got my man D Wheel in the building. Oh. <laughs> I got my man Angry Man in the building. <laughs> my man Monk Money. Man, you know what it is. And of course, man, it's your boy, the Hood Howard Stern Q Lewis, holding it down live from the 48205. Man, fuck with us Monday morning, 10 and 11, dog. See y'all. Ah, yeah, holla at us. <laughs>